Normally for alcohol use disorder and how it manifests in the workplace, it shows in several uh, behaviors. Um, one of it is in body language. If in meetings, they're just not as engaged or slouched consistently, that's one item. Another item is basically their energy level, their motivation. You notice that their response time to emails, to communication is much slower. You start to realize that their decision-making has gone down. Maybe in the beginning, they were a star performer and now their decision making is much more smaller. You're starting to see much more errors in types of the work that they um, produce to you. And another thing, you're starting to having much more one-on-ones with them in terms of repeating the same information that you felt like were one basic task or two, just something that they've you felt like they've already known they have done for about a year or two, but you've seen a, a regression in the last three to six months. They are at work, but then they're not really at work. You know, things such as, uh, they come in late um, in terms of their starting time or they leave early or you just don't really know what's going on in terms of their nine to five type of work. Um, other ways is that also in the meetings too as well, you start to notice that their focus, their mental presence is not really there. So again, it's one of this concept of like they're there physically, but then mentally, emotionally, they're not there. Well, if you um, have an employee with uh, alcohol, suspected alcohol use disorder, a lot of times what has happened in the past, it was kind of like this don't ask, don't tell uh, type of concept. You know, it's just like, let's leave it to HR, let's leave it to their benefits. But now with a program such as RIA Health, um, it's actually a... a opportunity for connection, an opportunity for treatment, you know, to be able to have information and resources where you can engage with an individual, get them the right treatment that does not take them away from the work, that they're able to get early treatment and prevention, but also still be able to become a stellar um, employee at work as well. Well, the reality of mental health issues in the workplace is basically the norm. What we've seen in post-COVID is that there, one, is a high consumption of alcohol use. Second is also with the post-pandemic, a lot of people have much more uh, stressors that led to depression, anxiety, and they have very limited resources with alcohol use. But what's basically needed across all workplace, a lot of managers that's needed, is basically more tools to address this, that how can they... Be, um, able to maintain this new reality of work, but ultimately help employees thrive. And RIA Health is a tool that it can work for managers. Mm -hmm.